Welcome to our video exploring Hong Kong movies from the 1960s. This was a decade of change and innovation for the film industry in Hong Kong, with new technologies and storytelling techniques being introduced, alongside a growing global audience for Asian cinema. We'll explore some of the most iconic films of this era, including martial arts classics and romantic dramas, and delve into their cultural significance both in Hong Kong and beyond. So sit back and join us on a journey through one of the most exciting periods in Hong Kong cinema history. Come Drink With Me is a Hong Kong wuxia film directed by King Hu. It stars Cheng Pei Pei as the lead character, Golden Swallow, a skilled fighter who sets out to rescue her brother from kidnappers. The movie was notable for its groundbreaking portrayal of women in martial arts films and paved the way for future female leads in the genre. It was also hugely successful at the box office and garnered critical acclaim for its choreography and cinematography. The One-Armed Swordsman is a martial arts film directed by Chang Che. The movie follows Fang Gang, played by Jimmy Wang Yu, who loses his arm after defending his master's daughter from bandits. He then learns how to fight with one arm and becomes an adept swordsman while seeking revenge against those who wronged him. This film set off a trend of one-armed hero movies in Hong Kong cinema that lasted several years. Dragon Inn, also known as New Dragon Gate Inn, is a wuxia film directed by King Hu. The movie takes place during the Ming Dynasty when eunuchs hold significant power over the emperor's court, which fuels political intrigue and corruption within China's government offices. The story follows several factions battling for control over intelligence reports on governmental affairs held inside an inn called Dragon Gate Inn located on the border between China and Mongolia. Golden Swallow is another wuxia action thriller starring Cheng Pei Pei as Golden Swallow once again but this time she seeks revenge against bandits who killed her father years earlier but are now threatening old friends of hers. There she meets Silver Rock, Lo Lia, an amnesiac former bandit turned monk, and they unite against ruthless enemies trying to take advantage of their situation.